because it's just so stupid how they're handling security. I mean, by eight o'clock, you can barely get in or out of the yard without being hassled. And after the whole thing with my car, it just makes everything so hard. It's not exactly like the campus is unsafe. Would it be so hard to get a few extra people watching the gates? You're the last person I would expect to be worried about campus safety. I'm not worried. I'm frustrated. Can't save the world. Well, if you really want to make a difference, you might consider volunteering. You know, shelters, soup kitchens. Uh, no, that's not my thing. Well, there's a lot of different ways to help people. And if you like it, volunteer work can be really rewarding. Where is all this coming from? Are you doing something that we're not aware of? Well, that was perceptive. We gave it away. You always talk it up when you do something new. Well, what is it? What'd you do? Well, okay, I'll tell you. <laughs> I am joining the Big Siblings Program. <laughs> the Big Siblings Program? You? I don't really see that. Okay, okay, I know, it's really not my thing. But I got this letter in the mail and I just really want to do it. So you just decided to do this little project out of the blue? Yeah. I guess I want to be a good person. Ooh, there's one little thing I'm going to need, though. References. My interview is this Thursday. I'm reassigning you. What? You're done with Valeno and you're done with High Hill Samurai. It's time to move on. Done with Valeno? Sir, I was hoping to get back into it after what they did to me. You're reassigned. It's over. Besides, I've got to team you up with a new partner and it'll take you some time to work out the uh, kinks. My new partner. What? You think now that Jack's gone, you're going solo? You've always worked with a partner and I'm not changing that now. Especially since you've been shot. Who the hell knows whether or not that bullet took away your edge. I haven't lost any edge. We'll find out soon enough. Well, who's my new partner, Thompson? No. Is it White? No. Not Mitchell Conley. Your new partner is from New York. New York? What'd he come here for? Boston's a step down from the NYPD. Not from the city. Upstate. Oh. Newburgh. It's a tough town, but a piece of cake compared to Dorchester. Well, when can I meet him? It's not a him. Frank. I'd like you to meet Detective Autumn Nogales. It's nice to finally meet you. Frank Carson. Sir, can, can, can I talk to you for a second, please? Anything you have to say, Detective, you can say with Autumn in the room. You shouldn't keep secrets with your partner, Frank. Isn't that right, Autumn? That's right. Okay. Fine. Candidly, and no offense to you, Autumn, but sir, I can't be paid with a woman. What? It's, it's just that I need a partner I can tell anything to. And I've never worked with a woman before. <laughs> Frank, I do not know what guy things you think you cannot tell Autumn. But truthfully, I do not give a damn. She's good, you need a partner, and that is the way it is going to be. But sir, this is final. Now, 
I want you to look into the deaths of two prostitutes in South Boston. Dead hookers. What the hell kind of assignment is that? You're just getting back. We're taking it slowly. I want to know if there's any connections between these two murders. This is a bull assignment, and I can tell you that right now. Maybe it is, but either way, it is what I've got for you. What are we waiting for? Let's get to it, people. Just want you to know, I really respect you, Carson. That work you did with Valeno, really great. And what exactly would you know about that? I read the file. The file? The file doesn't mention half of it. What am I missing? The reason you're working with me is because my last partner got too involved with one of his cases. Get in. Nice. Not really, but it's good for blending in. Look, Carson, I don't give a damn what you did with your last partner. I'm a good cop. And from what I've read, you're a pretty good cop, too. Don't call me Carson. Partner should be on a first name basis. Fine. But you can still call me Nogales. What, that Spanish? Hell, I don't even know what it means. Like I'm telling you. Alicia? Sophie, thank God, I need your help. 